Hey y'all, it's Dan here. Right back again with another tier list. This time it's gonna be the remake for the Mario tier list. Just note that this is all my opinion and y'all are free to disagree. And as a little bonus thing, um, I'm gonna be t having my opinion on who wins. Though I probably won't be going much in depth into it. If in depth at all. But with that said, you could say, let's -a go. So for the one we have Chris Pratt, I mean Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, they have a pretty iconic legacy with each other. And if not much really needs to be said here. They can both have some pretty quirky banter potential. They both have tons and tons and tons and tons of media to go off of. With both power-ups and debate-wise. But who, for who I think actually wins, I think Sonic would probably take it. With Super Sonic being way too much for Mario to handle. Um, for good ults, we have Popeye. Um, I think these two mainly just save, save women, but... With all Mario's other matchups, they don't really have connections anyways, so I'll take it. Um, I don't really have much to see on what the fight would be, but I just think it's pretty neat. For who I think wins, I think Popeye takes it with his insane tune force. Um, then, then we have Mickey Mouse from, well, Mickey Mouse. Uh, while this isn't really a rivalry per se, it's basically the king of video games versus the king of cartoons. It would be pretty epic. These two once again have like tons of media to go off of. And I think Mickey might take it. <laughs> he also has the pretty insane tune force. Like, being able to leave the cartoon and mess around with it. Um, then we have Kirby. Um, I don't get it that much, but I guess it's a pretty neat idea. Once again, I got no idea how the fight would go. But I probably bet on Kirby taking it. Since he is basically a god. One that would rival the one above all. Um, then we have Rayman, just so I can serve this, I guess, a guilty pleasure matchup of sorts. I don't really have a particular reason of liking it, but I, I don't know. Once again, I got no idea how the fight would go and stuff like that, but I think Mario definitely takes it. With being able to swim out of black holes and Rayman... Never getting onto that level. Uh, then we have the 3D Mario Battle Royale. With using Mario 64 Mario, Mario Sunshine Mario, Mario Galaxy Mario, and well, Mario Odyssey Mario. I sort of like these types of matchups. Especially when these different versions have different, way different fighting styles. And this rings true for this matchup. The Mario 64 Mario is pretty close range and personal. Uh, Mario Sunshine has slide and all of its different gear. Mario Galaxy Mario has all of its different power-ups and the spin attack. And Mario Odyssey Mario sort of has his, has Cappy. Um, for who I think went, I mean, I mean, these guys sort of have a lot, there's a lot of cool moments you, that could be had. Like, maybe near the end of the fight, Mario 64 Mario and Mario Galaxy Mario could sort of duke it out of the skies, and it would be so epic. But for who I think wins... I probably found Mario Galaxy Mario. In fourth place, it will probably be Sunshine. I 
His water really doesn't hurt the rest of the civilians as well. They will probably be trying to go ahead and fill the others up with water then. But they're probably going to be moving much faster than any of the other bosses. Third place Odyssey, which might be a bit controversial. He can possess the Mario's, which is useful. But 64 and Galaxy just have, just have better, like, range with being able to fly, which might overwhelm him. And then Galaxy just has better face than 64. For fine, we have Link from The Legend of Zelda. They're ba basically Nintendo's biggest, biggest characters who say... The Amazons in distress, Zelda being Peach and Zelda. I know Zelda technically isn't a damsel, but Link has had to save her a few times. Um, I don't know. I don't think these two would particularly have interest, have interact with their abilities, but they do have pretty good connections, and the music would be good. So it sort of saves it. We have Mega Man from, well, the Mega Man franchise. I think Smash Bracket with its fight animation sort of shows what you could do with it. While it really doesn't have any connections, these two have a ton of abilities to work with. And they could bounce off very well. Uh, then we have Crash Bandicoot. Which is more of unsure, as I have no idea on how to feel about it. But I put it in fine for now. Then we're in eh, and I'm just gonna group up Steve's, Sans, Pac Man, and Banjo and Kazooie all into one, because I have almost the same reasoning to dislike them. Um, they're all just very boring. All have to do with Mario being a mascot, and it's so uninteresting. And Mario takes them all with pretty ease. Um, then we have Luigi, which is supposed to be in no things, but um, I ran out of space. It's it's also so boring as well. They have almost the exact same power-ups with only a few differences. And it's pretty out of character for both. And I have no idea who takes it. And for no space, we have Optimus Prime. They are both... And, and I'm just going to wrap it through all of the no space like that. Because it's pretty easy to see why I dislike them all. Uh, connections between Mario, Optimus Prime, Red and Blue character is very uninteresting. Mario probably takes it. Hat Kid, they are both video game characters, no connections and no potential at all. Mario takes it. Um, that's from Earthbound. Nintendo characters are in Smash Bros. Just why? That's my take. It. Um, Bugs Bunny. Honestly, just a way worse version of Mario vs. Mickey. Um, Bugs probably takes it. Um, Mario vs. Cuphead. They're both red care brothers. I mean, it's so uninteresting as well. Mario easily takes it. Um, Mario vs. SpongeBob. They are both characters. Anyways, I'm pr I don't know who wins. And then Mario vs. Superman, they have no connections at all, and only a fly battle can save it. <sighs> there we go. But yeah, that's just my tier list. Let me know if y'all disagree if I miss any particular opponents. Well, and for next time, we gotta go fast!